Hey everyone, I'm Nate. And I'm Abby. We are the RC Sailors and check this out. Boom. We have a real RC vehicle to share with you. This is the Thunder Tiger Bushmaster. It's four wheel drive. It's got a lot of metal on here, a lot of aluminum, and it's reinforced with some carbon fiber here on the back. We'll take a closer look at this in a later vi uh, video, but in today's video, we want to see how fast it goes with our big five GPS meter. You can't buy it anymore, unfortunately. It's all banged up, but this thing is amazing. And before we uh, really do the official test here, just listen to this. Oh yeah, let's go. <laughs> Sounds amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there is a speaker inside there. It's really cool. Holy moly. All right, get the speedometer thingy in there, Nathan. It's uh, it's reactive to your throttle. That's cool. So as you juice it up, uh, listen here, and, and then when it, it'll die if you let it go idle for a minute. So you just barely touch it, and it starts. <laughs> and listen to the throttle here. Amazing. <laughs> we are. If you don't like that, you can turn it off completely. You can turn it up and down. We have it at the recommended level. You're not supposed to have it up uh, for extended periods of time because it can blow it out. It's pretty loud. And uh, today we're gonna just run what the recommended stock settings on everything is. Uh, I'll show you the batteries that we're running and stuff just so you know. But we have two batteries in here as series. Uh, they're both two cell 5,000 milliamp batteries, so it's actually running like a 14.8 volt 5,000 milliamps. If it was parallel, it'd be 2S 10,000 milliamps. We'll talk more about that probably in some more battery education videos. <laughs> but today we really just want to rip this uh, open. We're going to do it in the grass here. I know that grass is going to slow us down a little bit, but if you look at our grass, it's kind of like golf course. But we're uh, gonna do like, it out on the on the road too. Yeah, and we just want to see if we can get. We've never really done a speed test on the grass. Here's my question. I want to see how much faster it is on the road. Well, versus that. The grass. And I'm wondering if you turn the speaker off, will it give it enough juice to go a little faster? It's possible, but ultimately, I want to test that. This thing is just a beast, and it's so much fun. It's got such nice <laughs> metal parts throughout, uh, and the motor. Just look at this motor. How huge that brushless motor is. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. We're just waiting on the big five GPS meter to find satellites and uh, then we will just have some fun with this. See, you all oh, what we'll do to, to test your theory is disconnect the speaker here. Yeah. It just has a little JST plug. Uh -huh. So if we want to see if it actually makes it go any faster, cool. we'll just disconnect. I want to do that. I didn't bring any Velcro like I should have, so we just kind of uh, fit it in here, but I don't think it'll fall out there. So That'll be good enough just to get a quick speed test. And if this is your first speed test you've seen of ours, this is the Big Five GPS meter. They don't sell these anymore. Right. But they actually sell something really similar, and I'll try to link it for you in the description Let's box. Do this. Get out of the way. I'm just going to take it down kind of easy. Then we'll juice it down. And don't and forget, we're going to go on the concrete here yes. in a second. I just wanted to see if there's a difference in the grass. There will be. Asphalt. Don't hit me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's fast it's for fast. grass, that is. Now this can do uh, 3S, two 3S batteries. And uh, you can just change the pinion gear out and hit higher speeds, but we personally don't like to go Check 100 it. miles an hour. See what you hit. We'll do the conversion here on the screen. What's it say? 54 kilometers an hour. All right, my turn 54. on the grass. A little bit of a technical issue here. The uh, Big 5 GPS meter, we've had a lot of problems with this in the past, although it's made in years, I can't complain. Uh, really. You broke it in the I broke it. 5,000 yeah, pieces I know. before. Uh, right now, one of my buttons has come loose inside of here, and so I can't switch the mode from the time. So the speed test video is gonna have to end here. Abby and I had a little bit of a debate just now, almost a husband-wife, argument you might say uh, uh should we not do the video or just will people understand i say you guys are going to understand we're not scientists here it's just normal joe schmo and joe schmo's wife well now that you say that of course they're gonna be like yes of course we understand but if you wouldn't have said that all the serious truck people would have been like you so, guys suck i don't think there's that many serious <laughs> truck people that watch our videos anyway. no i don't so, think so anymore you know we try to give you guys 
both real world uh, examples of how things work. And some of that is also our equipment. And uh, at least we got one speed test out of it. So that should give you a pretty close indication of how this runs. Yeah, we probably could have gone five kilometers an hour faster on the road, which would have been like two or three miles an hour faster on the road versus the grass. But ultimately, this is quick and it's heavy and powerful and we can still have a bashing video. Abby and I are gonna do our best to buy another GPS unit. We have our eye on one. Uh, you just, you know us. We don't like to waste our patrons' money uh, unless we need that money. So we'll probably have to do that. And big shout out to our patrons because uh, you guys help keep the equipment coming to our channel when we need it. So if you'd like to support us and help us have the good stuff going like that, then uh, we'll have our Patreon linked in the description box below. But this car is amazing. And we did disconnect the, uh, uh, the speaker. So if you listen now, there's no sound. You could easily take that out. But I mean, let's face it, if you're gonna spend that kind of money on a ground vehicle, then you probably, if you, the speaker's if you pretty cool. know it has a speaker like that, pretty sure you might as well just use it. I think that's awesome. Let's see if we can fill fire up if it was that easy. Oh, oh yeah, I like that a lot. I mean, just makes just, you smile. Just makes you smile. And that's what this hobby's all about, is just having fun. And uh, you know, we got a rough speed test out. Sorry we couldn't do a little bit more uh, with that for you guys, but we have an equipment failure and it's probably gonna take a month or two to get another one of these. So I don't think we need to drag this out. I just really wanted to show you guys this buggy. It's really cool. Be sure to subscribe because we're going to do a bashing video with it very soon. And we're excited about it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>